A dangerous day for children going home for the Labor Day weekend. One is dead after he was hit by a school bus full of children. Three other teenagers were hurt in a separate crash. The accidents happened within hours of each other this afternoon. The first one was in Willis. That second one was in Northeast Houston. And Eyewitness News reporter Jessica Willie is live in the Texas Medical Center to explain how the weekend has gotten off on such a somber note. Jessica? Yeah, Tom, two Sheldon ISD students, 15 and 16 years old, are at Memorial Hermann Hospital here in the medical center in critical condition. A Willis ISD student never made it to the hospital just minutes after the last bell rang today. Tragedy struck. The holiday weekend had barely started and already students in two school districts were victims. In Willis, an accident involving a school bus took one life. In Northeast Harris County, three teens were seriously wounded. They were my closest friends. Omar Gonzalez usually walks with the boys. On this day, he was lagging behind. It probably saved his life. It was bad. Harris County accident investigators say the boys were walking home from C.E. King High School when a pickup truck struck them. One flew over the hood. Another was pinned underneath the truck. The third just fell down. Investigators say the driver was distracted. He said he had uh, something had rolled off of the, the center console down near his feet, and he was trying to trying to get that while he was driving, and he looked down to see where it was. In Willis, a school had just let out. A high school student had the passenger door open and was reaching for something at the intersection of Highway 75 and FM 830 when the driver, his friend, hit the gas and accidentally threw him out. Within seconds, a school bus full of students struck and killed him. Willis ISD officials say the driver never saw the teen. Tuesday will be a difficult day. And on Tuesday, grief counselors will be available in Willis ISD for students to talk to. No word tonight from DPS whether that driver of the pickup will face any charges. The driver of the pickup in the Northeast Harris County accident passed a field sobriety test. That investigation is ongoing. Reporting live tonight from the Texas Medical Center, Jessica Willie, 13 Eyewitness News.